The process of live mass casting starts with what looks like rich, lumpy oatmeal sitting in a bowl. When painted on the face, the gook is cold, slimy, and embracing. The rubber-like substance, called alcomoulage, is similar to the material dentists use to make impressions. In this case, however, it's the details of a three-dimensional head that the rubber will mold to. The alcomoulage is applied over the eyes, across the mouth and onto the neck, with only the open nostrils a sign of life underneath. The experience is one that claustrophobics can do without. I heard conversation going on around me, and I, I couldn't respond or add to it because my mouth was firmly sealed. I could hear through my ears even though they were covered. I had some thoughts, I must say, about any kind of emergencies such as wanting to go to the bathroom and so forth. The rubbery substance dries quickly and plaster impregnated gauze is next applied for reinforcement. The whole process took about two hours. Then it was time to be set free. The mold will be used to make a solid plaster head that will be used in a new Planet Ocean exhibit to open late this year. Once completed, the head will be used as a projection screen for the face of Dr. F.G. Walton Smith, Planet Ocean's director, as he narrates the new exhibit. Anasqui, Channel 4 News.